what is up YouTube and welcome to another Crips on Excursion. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Play road intro. KZE, can you show more of the rap? Crips on Excursion. Oh, you guys leave with your little bed? KZE, what's the next dog breed you'll own for a day? The next dog will be Chico, which is a bull terrier. Look forward to that video. Why are you screaming? DRZ still needs to be fixed. This is broken. No speed cable on this thing. The throttle tube is nice and stuck. Pretty sure it's still rideable. The only thing keeping this from running is the battery. I need to purchase a battery for this thing. That's an easy fix. More DRZ videos coming soon. The rat. the rat is at his prime, hasn't gotten sick in quite some time, which is always good. The fruit never changes. I don't think he's ever gotten sick, honestly. Have you ever gone check that fruit? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. How often and how much do you feed crypto every day? This is the food I give him, Purina 1, lamb and rice formula. He seems to like this one. It has two types, it has the actual kibble and the lamb itself. He usually nitpicks the lamb at the beginning. I serve him three of these throughout the whole day. One in the morning, the second one being around four, and the third and last one at night time. Here's one, nice and full for them. Let's go ahead and weigh this. That weighs one pound, so I feed him three pounds of kibble each day. Want some food? That is not a pound. Is that a pound? So you're saying what? Get your food. I did stop feeding crypto raw meat since you can't really mix the two kibble and raw because the dogs digest them at different paces. So I just completely stopped giving him raw, even though it is completely fine to feed your dog raw chicken at any point. Does crypto want to Does crypto want to go run? Yeah. Look at the smile! Look at the smile on this one! Mm -hmm. It's okay, it's okay. The rod! Oh. Get it, the rod! Careful with the rat. <laughs> Is the rat the alpha? Hmm? No! No! KZE, when are you gonna make another car video? Let me know if we should make a video on Plasti dipping the Z. But the Z did receive some front window tint. Not sure if you guys are able to tell. This car is tinted all throughout now. Four window tint on the side as well as on the rear and then the front I got a three window tint it just gives it a nicer appearance instead of being able to see completely through the car it looks black oh KZE that's so illegal I don't put no miles on it deep dish rims for this car that would make it look extremely nice at the moment this car is completely stuck except for the SSR cat back that it has 2007 Nissan 350Z it's a little bit dirty because of crypto's nose that's with three tint and that's no tint does make it pretty dark in here which I personally am a fan of does crypto like darkness <laughs> might as well hide the dog let's hide the dog when we're traveling it's not extremely tinted it just gives it a little bit of a nicer fade. <laughs> he is so ready to go somewhere. Why is it so dark up there? Oh no. The rat's gonna start something. I just sense it. The rat. The rat.
They both want each other so bad, yet they're so shy to do it. Just do it. I know you guys are secretly lovers. I've been getting a lot of requests for me to make a skating with your dog video. I have already made one prior to this long ago. Skating with your dog is extremely useful. If you have dog breeds such as a Siberian Husky, yes, other dog breeds are capable of mushing. I have previously mushed with YG, which is a German Shepherd, as well as Rex, which is a pit bull. Most likely any dog breed is capable of mushing, of pulling you on a skateboard. What really depends is how long a dog can run for. Of course, the pit bull and the German Shepherd won't run as much as the Siberian Husky. Doesn't mean it's not possible. This here is the longboard I've been using for quite some time now. This is the Palatian longboard. It's listed down in the description. This board was around $60. A perfect beginner board. You don't necessarily need a longboard. The reason I would recommend anybody to start off with the longboard is simply because you have much more platform to stand on, leading to better balance as well as these bigger wheels. Bigger wheels are extremely needed if you're going to be riding through places like this where there's huge logs if i was to step on that branch with normal skateboard wheels i would most definitely go flying it's a little bit easier to go over objects as well as it's a much smoother ride you will either need a skateboard with bigger wheels which is how i first started riding with crypto with the normal skateboard with bigger wheels or a longboard i would personally recommend a longboard a longboard is by far the easiest way to exercise any dog if your dog likes to pull another really important thing you need will be a harness it's up to you what type of harness this here is the Explorer Harness by Front Pet. KZE, how old should my dog be in order for them to start mushing? Your dog should be at least one year old. I, you should not be heavily exercising a puppy. Since they're still growing, you don't really want to mess with their growth. KZE, but my dog is so energetic. How else can I run them? You can run a puppy. You just can't allow them to pull you. Wait a year until your dog grows a bit, and then you could allow them to pull you. Let me go over exactly how my first experience with mushing with Crypto went. I put the leash on his collar because because he was pulling dramatically since I didn't want him to go extremely fast. If your dog is extremely energetic and just takes off full speed, try starting with the leash on the collar. Oh, it's McTwitch. Let's see. Good. Is that McTwitch? Watch him, Crypto. Hey. <laughs> Where are you going, Crypto? Yeah. No, no, no. Oh. Oh. Yeah, you're having fun. Oh, can I pet you? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on, come on. <laughs> come on. Are, are you going to be the dog that rides a skateboard? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I hear it. Come on, this way. Bye. Come on. Okay. Okay, we got mysteriously interrupted, but that's completely fine. That's the homie McTwitch. Ruger also really trips out on him. I have no idea what's wrong. I think he's a cool guy. With these bigger wheels, you're able to go much higher speed. Oh, KZE, my dog doesn't pull or he wants to pee. He goes off trail. Not all dogs enjoy pulling. Some dogs prefer just nice little walks, just like the rat. But I do have another how to skate with your dog video where I go much more into detail and where I don't get interrupted. I go over commands and a couple warnings. Go ahead and check that video of mine out. And if you still have questions after watching that video, ask me and hashtag it, hashtag Q&A. Feel free to follow me on Instagram and on Snapchat at KZE underscore production.